Lots of fun with our pants. Hello there guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Roxanne. If it's your first time here, then welcome. It looks like I'm not wearing a shirt. <laughs> Um, today I want to talk to you guys about my TBR for books about books. I have been really in a mood to read books about books and that I've just been getting a lot of them lately so I just wanted to talk to you guys about them because you might not have seen them because I don't really do hauls anymore. I might do one every now and then um, but I've kind of stopped doing them so TBRs and wrap ups are really when you guys get to see which books I own. So, yeah, I'm just going to talk about these. And as always, I really don't know a lot about books when I go into them. I kind of read the synopsis once, decide that I want to read it, and then don't read the synopsis ever <laughs> again. Um, so I don't know a lot about a lot of these, but they're just the books that I have on my shelves that are about books about books, bookish books. Um, so this is by the book by Julia Sunburn. Sunborn, um, and I think this is about a woman who's trying to get uh, tenure or her master's Trying to write a book. Oh, okay. She's trying to write a book. So uh, it has books on the cover It's a really cute sort of contemporary looking book. So yeah Next I have a non-fiction and it is called Library, An Unquiet History by Matthew Battles. And I got this one on sale at the Strand Bookstore. And as you guys may know, I'm going to start this fall going to get my master's in library sciences. So I want to read all about libraries and all about books and all about their history. So I got this one and I'm very excited to read it. I have a few um cozy murder mysteries that are bookish we have books two and three in the bibliophile mystery series actually just kidding these might be like four and five or th not two and three these might be three and four i don't know i will look it up and put it right here but they are murder under cover and the lies that bind so if these are about um brooklyn Wayne Wright and she is a book restoration expert and also has a master's in library sciences so I wanted to get those and then we have Death by Coffee a bookstore cafe mystery by Alex Erickson which is about a bookstore cafe owner I'm sure. <laughs> um, then we have Summer Hours at the Robbers Library by Sue Halpin and I think this is about um, a person who has to go do some community service in a library after they've committed a crime and so their punishment is community service. They get community service hours and they do that at a library I think and so that's what this is about. Another library one. Then we have The Bookshop on the Corner by Jenny Colgan. I know nothing about this one. Um, oh, she's a, it's about a, a, a main character named Nina Redmond, who is a literary matchmaker reading a reader, pairing a reader with that perfect book is her passion and also her job. So this seems to be another sort of cutesy um, contemporary that I'm excited to read. Uh, then we have one that I'm pretty sure is a nonfiction, but I'm actually not 100% sure because it sounds like a heist story. Oh, True Tale. Okay, very cool. So this is The Badass Librarians of Timbuktu and The Race to Save the World's Most Precious Manuscript by Joshua Hammer. And this I've heard is like part history, part heist story almost. So there's this one. Then we have The Thirteenth Tale by Diane Setterfield. It looks like this one. You might have seen this around. It's, this one's pretty popular, I think. This one's just about an author and her life, and it's supposed to be very mysterious and very atmospheric and sort of have that, that feel, that, that dark but also cozy, very, I don't know, that feeling you get when you read certain books about books. This one's really supposed to have it, and so... That's as much as I know about that one because it was more how the readers feel when they read it that called me to it. Um, not not really so much the story because, I, like I said, I really don't know what it's about. Then we have The Storied Life of A.J. Fickrey by Gabrielle Zevin. And this is about a book. This is about a book owner who 
is not having a very good time of it and then his most prized possession is stolen um, and then a mysterious package appears at the bookstore its unexpected arrival gives Fikri the chance to make his life over I've heard really good things about this one and then I got um, I posted um, some of these together in my Instagram I will link my Instagram down below if you'd like to follow me there um, and I talked about how they were all books about books and actually um, Harper Perennial commented on it and said have you tried this book and I said I have not but I will look into it and they were kind enough to send it to me and so they sent The Library at the Edge of the World by Felicity Hayes McCoy and it, they sent the arc for the second book which comes out I think in September um, and this is about a, an Irish woman who works in a mobile library so she drives around um, and and is in charge of this mobile library which sounds like the best freaking job in the world so my battery died so this is me a few like 30 minutes later um so i just wanted to shut up <laughs> i just wanted to show you guys what the second book in the i guess i don't know what type what series this is but the library at the edge of the world the second book for this one it is this one it is called summer at the garden cafe and it also has a book in the cover and a little teapot on top of it so it's super cute um and so thank you to harper for sending me these it's not sponsored or anything they just were very nice to, to go ahead and send that to me so those are the books in my physical tbr pile that are books about books um let me know if you've read any of them and what you thought let me know if you think there are any of these that i should make a priority and as always thank you for watching and for listening i love you guys very very much 